I wanted to show you guys the room that we're trying to make into Noah's sensory room. Then we're gonna do the beach. I like beats. Boss. We're gonna do a beach? Yeah. Good afternoon, guys. We have had a very productive morning. Just kidding. He woke up at like 6.30 this morning and did so much work before the kids got up. He took all the Ikea furniture upstairs because that's where it needs to go. He's unpacked boxes, took boxes upstairs, so he's been working hard. I edited a video this morning. <laughs> yeah. I know. We have worked really hard this week, like so, so hard. So today is kind of a relaxed day. It doesn't mean we're not gonna do anything, but we're definitely going to be taking it a lot easier. Ashley's gonna be coming over. She actually took off two days of work so she could have five days off to come help us. And her help has been amazing. Not just her help, but like her kids entertaining my kids has been a blessing. So I'm very, very, very appreciative of her help, but I'm not appreciative of these stairs. My calves hurt so bad. It feels like I went to Disney for three three days. Maybe I'm just really out of shape. Okay, I'm really out of shape. So today I think we're gonna go to Target to get some beddings for the kids because I love Target bedding so much and also we have everything for Lex and Lonnie's room. These are their beds from Ikea. These are their mattresses from Nicely. This is part of their dresser from Ikea. So we're gonna try to put it all together. The theme of Lima Noah's rooms is going to be like Marvel superheroes and superhero squad, but the bed we want to get him, we have to order from Cole. Danielle's room is the only room that has all the furniture in it. I'm gonna tell you guys how I want the layout of my room. Of course, there's my bed here, then there's my dresser. All those clothes right there are hung, need to be hung up, but I don't have hangers yet. Because we haven't unpacked everything. Over there is where I'm gonna have my TV, and then under I'm gonna have stuff for my cat that I'm getting in like September. We still have to bring our king bed up here. But I think I got half the kids in clean clothes right now, so I've gotta work on that. That is just the hardest part right now, is just making sure we're taking care of our daily stuff while trying to get ready. It's probably gonna be another week before we're actually like fully unpacked. Not even fully situated, but just unpacked. And I'm so glad we made this move at the end of May instead of waiting till like July, because this will give the kids some time to settle down before school starts. Making state of mind. Eyes blind and it is getting dangerous I don't wanna fight the feeling inside Cause your words are so contagious Are you judging your brother right now? With those judgy little eyes Oh guys, that was so much work But our king mattress is no longer in the middle of the floor Yes, Daddy, I, and Lonnie moved it upstairs and it was a workout. It, it was definitely a workout, but I'm glad it is a foam mattress. It's from Nicely and it's that kind of like memory foam mattress. So it was able to kind of bend easier than a regular mattress would. If we had a regular King mattress, there's no way it would fit up there. But Danielle and Noah are playing some Super Nintendo. And then Liam's playing. Yeah, he's so cute. And I've been working on the kitchen because we need to do a big grocery trip, which I'll do a grocery haul for you guys. But first we need to get the kitchen done, organize all that good stuff. So I've kind of been working on it. It's getting close to being done. This is gonna be like our little coffee station. I'm gonna get a K cup holder right here. But honestly, I've said this before, it's gonna be a couple months before our house starts coming together with things because there's a lot of things that we need. I'm not gonna go out and make myself broke buying everything. So we're just gonna slowly get it. We have things prioritized. I'm making myself a list. You are a heavy girlfriend. Oh my lord. We could not find Liam's clothes, so while we're in Target, we're gonna get him some shorts and a shirt. We got Liam the cutest little outfit. Oh, look at that hat. Okay, that's really cute. He needs that hat. Yeah, I know, he won't keep it on. But Liam loves sharks. He's gonna be super cute. Um, let's go down here. We aren't getting Noah's thing yet, even though I want to, like, look how cute that is. This is a full queen, this is a twin. So let's get that. We're getting two twins. And what kind of sheet set do you think they need? That one? Okay, get two of those. Liam, how did you get that? Did daddy give that to you? Bat dad. Bat dad. Bat dad. Daddy shark. Daddy shark. There it is. This is what I've been looking for all along.
Well, we are done at Walmart. We picked up a few things we needed, just like a baking pan. We picked up a pizza thing. I don't know if Ashley's still coming over or what time she's gonna come over, but it was fun. This is the Walmart we always went to. It's just awesome to be back and feel like we're back home. I don't know why, like we lived in Jacksonville. Here's your keys, baby. It's hot, guys. We lived in Jacksonville longer than St. Pete area, but it always just feels home. Like, it just feels like we're back home, and it's an amazing feeling. We personally are ready to get settled in so we can kind of enjoy our summer. Probably gonna get the water park uh, annual passes. Lots of kids' videos. Check out my kids' channel. We're trying to get settled in as quick as possible so we can resume regular videos and so we can get the videos on the kids' channel going and just get into a routine with the kids. And you're gonna see some daddy do videos. I'm gonna be doing different projects you get to watch. We have a little room if you guys haven't seen our house tour but we have a little under the stairs room that we call our Harry Potter room. We're gonna make that into Noah's sensory room because we were kind of like what could we do? I was like well I guess we could put like our vacuum and stuff in it but the more I thought about it I want somewhere downstairs that Noah can go to that's a safe place for him and it's downstairs because trying to get him all the way across the house up the stairs into his room to calm down in the middle of a meltdown that's just not gonna happen so we need somewhere that we can put him safe that he would like I talked to him about it and he loves that room so much already like he spends so much time in that room we're going to just make that into a sensory sensory room but i did say that lonnie should paint like a nine and three quarters thing on the other side of the door it'll <laughs> Just either be that room or the garage i'm gonna put make it a sensory room i want him to have a safe place but the garage is really hot so when he gets hot it makes his meltdowns worse we have a lot of projects we have a lot of things that we need to get going on but we're just trying to take it a little bit at the time we don't want to do too much because we also want to enjoy the area as well we don't want to be cooped up in our house all the time we love our house our house is beautiful but we want to get outside and do things that i can tell you guys and not having a computer set up has been the nicest thing Ever. The kids are having to find other things to do, like Daniel's playing the Super Nintendo with Noah today. Bonnie Jr. has been finding some shows on Netflix. So it's been a really good thing, and they're really excited to like go do stuff, go to the beach, go around the area. Okay, so guys, guys, Lex evidently leaked through a little bit on his peeing on these mattresses from Nicely. It's waterproof. Like, there's the stain. You can see it. Yeah, there's the stain, but there is no stain on the bed at all. If you don't know, after we had Penelope, we actually got a king bed from Nicely and we absolutely love it. It is so, so comfy. And they were nice enough to send us two twin beds for the boys' rooms. thing is in addition to all of that if you want your own nicely bed there's a discount code in the description below they are just so so comfortable I mean, look at that look how comfy it is it's like i love it it's so good i'll show you guys after everything's set up lonnie is putting the kids ikea beds together we're very excited to see what it looks like we picked up the bedding the mattress protector comes tomorrow and even though like you don't need it it's waterproof i don't want to take that chance either i want to make sure the mattresses are protected as much as possible building your bed? Yeah. Do you want to go hang out in Sissy's room? Yeah. Okay, because I don't want you to get hurt in here, okay? Okay. You want to help Sissy clean her room? Yeah. Okay, go. Don't help her organize it. Yeah. Hold my hand. Oh, yeah. You might be wondering what I am doing. 
because Ashley's helping Lonnie, but I have a really important job and it's to keep them company. No other person can do it like I can. But guys, look how nice this bed is. I mean, I just laid on the bed so the bed's not all cute like it was, but like, look how nice that is. I am sleepy. You're sleepy? Yes. So, both Lex and Lonnie's beds are put together. Both cribs are put together. The only thing Lonnie has to do is tomorrow, he needs to put together the boy's dresser. All three of the younger kids are put to bed. I wanted to show you guys the room that we're trying to make into Noah's sensory room. You guys have probably already seen it if you saw my house tour, but this is actually really deep in here. So I think this would be really good. And it's not hot or anything like that in here. I think it would be a good room. Because using his bedroom as a sensory room or a meltdown room is sometimes really tricky because I want him to have things in his room. But of course, if he's going to be trying to break things and things like that, I can't have it in his room. So that's kind of our plan. We will keep you updated with that. But if you are new to our landing crew, please hit that red subscribe button. We would love for you to be a cup pot. I can't even talk. Just, just hit the red subscribe button. All right, good night. Where you move, make me blind. You will always be there. There's no doubt in my mind.